it was a really good weekend. Uh, second UCI stage race the team has done this year. Um, and yeah, some really good parkours. Um, and so, yeah, and it was really good results to get in the top 10, uh, to be in the top five uh, in a big race like that against so many different national teams. Um, yeah, and re- everyone in the team rode, rode amazing. Uh, Carl on the last stage was awesome, supporting me up, uh, giving me a wheel when I, when I needed one. Um, so yeah, all in all, it was a really great weekend for the team. On the road stages, uh, I was up there in all of them. Uh, probably just the, the time trial. I think as a team, maybe we could have all, if we'd have all done a better time trial, that would have put us high up in the team classification um, and we'd have all been a bit further up in GC. Um, so yeah, I think the time trial really. Um, but the next time trials, we've got the one in Spain and then in Tour of Wales, they're, they're a bit more suited to me, a bit, a bit hillier. So yeah, hopefully I can push on and do well, but a bit better in them time trials. Yeah, I mean, the setup as the team, uh, it was it was the same as always, um, which is amazing. Uh, the support you get when you finish your race, everything's there straight away for you to make sure that you can recover straight away for the next stage. Uh, all the SIS stuff, whatever you need, as many gels, as many bars. Um, Tony and Carol supporting you through, during the race and uh, obviously Mark behind in the car. Um, if you have any problems in the race, um, into food and stuff as soon as we get back to the hotel, food's ordered and stay on the table. So yeah, it's, it's more than you could ask for. The organization of the race was fantastic. To, have a stage which is 100 kilometers on the last day from the the other two days uh that was a pretty good experience it made it more like a tour than just than just racing around the town each day with slightly very different loops um all of the uh, all the presentations were yeah done straight away afterwards we never had any problems and i think the parkours that the organizers chose were were really good and made for a really tough race as was seen by the results with only 60 riders finishing on the last stage the the stage races we've got coming up for the rest of this year they have a bit more of a maybe a mountain day in them um so if i can get up there in the flat stages like i have done in poland and holland um and then push on and try and get some time back on the guys that have got time on me on the time trials then there's no reason why i can't get even further up in the gc um so yeah that's that that's why I'll, I'll always try for the breaks on the flat stages but hopefully in the mountain stages which is to come i can uh perform perform better the race in scotland that we've got in two weeks time um it looks really good um i've checked out the course on the website and uh yeah it looks like a really tough race looks like one of the best national series this year hopefully um the team have got Stuart from scotland from not too far from that race so i'm sure he'll be looking to do quite well and uh if he needs it i'll definitely be there to help him out um not that the the races in the uk aren't my main target this year so um yeah go there help the team out and uh Hopefully we can come away with a win.